All right, so I got the good ending, Mike. Last well, I guess one. we're gonna switch places. I can play some a little bit, and you can choose sometimes. Sometimes too. You played. Are we gonna do that? Or yeah. Right. Yeah. Give me a sec. Bah. Oh, just to get up and move. Boop. <sighs> Watch yourself. Alright. Alright, let's do this there thing. Yeah, alright. Alright. Even now, Stanley's office was a distant memory. Wait. What did it look like? There was a computer, perhaps, and a painting. Was it a painting? I don't or a think we're at a Even new ending. Oh, uh, that was not. Was it a painting or a photo? Uh, I can't remember. There's a painting there. That's a lovely painting. I like that painting. Oh, this is weird. Nice landscape. Uh. Okay. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he which way? I don't know which way, man. Can't go that way. <laughs> which way? This way? Either one of those two, the either left or right. Those two doors. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew <laughs> it Oops. well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just, just to, to admire it. it. Yeah, I do. It's a very nice room. Very nice room. They have awesome coffee. What was it about this room that called so deeply? Coffee. So um, it's grace. It's it is. What time is it? No. It is. It was something deep. Eleven. Eleven twenty-five. Almost. Twenty-one to twenty-four. Almost twenty-one to twenty-five. Back to business. Stanley took the first open door on his left. We went that way before, huh? Yeah, pretty much. But we didn't go. Through no, we did. We did all that. We didn't go that I way. Think, I think we did all that, yeah. Well, we went down the elevator at one time, but there's another way. Yeah, that was a uh, freaking. Uh, all right, well, let's go this way. Stanley was so bad Fuck it. We, we didn't stay on this. Uh, oh, yeah, let's go stay this on. thing. I jumped. I ran off of it once so it was high enough. We'll, we'll chill out on this thing. Well, you went through that way. Yeah, I went through that way. Through that way so I don't think there's another way that way. I realize that investing your trust no, in that door is shut. Okay, well. So you'll just have to sit on here and wait till you get to the other side. Look at all the boxes. Or you could try and kill yourself right there. I'm, I could, sure, I'm sure I could kill myself. Be just straight up suicide. Please, stop trying to make every decision by yourself. I'm not asking for me. I'm asking for All right, all right. I'm asking for her. Whoa! See if you hit there long enough, you actually because he you cut him off early. Yeah, I did. Yeah, okay. See. What? Who's her? This is this is different. Who's she? Well, let's find out who's who she. Who's she? Who's her? Who's she? Who is she? Who's she be? It's a dark room. Be right there. Very dark. Uh. Okay. Whoa! Hello, light. You need to be the one to do this. To reach out. Maybe I should have waited a little longer. Yeah, a little bit. Hmm. Well, you picked up the phone. Oh, Stanley, is that you? Uh, hold on, sweetie. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm just pulling the bread out of the oven. Oh, so oh, apparently I have a woman who oh, bakes I'm bread. To come in and tell me all about You're dead. Dead. What the f what? what the balls? Gotcha. You're a dick. Oh, come on. Did you actually think you had a life? <laughs> Kinda <laughs> did. <laughs> oh, shut <laughs> up. Look at apartment 427. Ah, uh, yeah. That's fucked up. Come inside. Let me show you what's Dushy move there, dude. Should we Dushy just move? Should we go inside or leave? Or? Yeah, might as well. We, we want to go inside? Well, that? I don't know. Can you can you go? Fuck that, then. Fuck that room. Sure. No. Yeah, so that's fuck, that room. Room. Look at, look, fuck that room. Fuck that room. You can see everything I in there. I don't care. You can no. see everything in there, no. basically. No, fuck that room. Uh, yeah. I don't like that room. Ah! Uh, okay. Alright, uh... So, apparently, we have to go in that room, then. Um... I didn't mean to offend you, Mr. Uh, narrator, sir, there, dude. Good guy. Stop humping the wall. <laughs> 
counterproductive. This is a very sad story about the death of a man named uh, I'm not liking this story. Good morning, employee for plus LT on your on your gamepad. What? Left trigger. Oh my god. The controller's working. Your, kind of. your Super Nintendo controller is working. It does. <laughs> Holy crap! I can you can't look though. You have no. to. Have oh, I don't have the LT thing on this gamepad though. Good morning. I think there isn't. I think that's just a fucking joke. No, I don't think so. You have to hit that button. Let's yeah. just unplug that. Yeah. See if that actually changes it. No. Really? Did we broke it? I think we broke it. Really? What the fuck is going on here? It's because you have it, to actually it? push that button. I don't think there is that button. I know. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, my. God, left. Uh, it's always doing the gamepad. That's crap. Hmm. I have a left bumper on this. There we go. I have a left bumper. What are you going to use the gamepad now? Plus the game. Look at him there, pushing buttons. He's eating lunch. I'm not eating lunch. Playing the Stanley Parable, Parable with a Super NES USB controller. Yes! Except that he's chosen his life. Press X. Oh my god. It actually knows what X is? Oh no, no, that's you push X. Oh, okay. No? Wait, wait, wait. Oh no, it, was, it meant Y. In his mind, he can go on fantastic. It meant Y on this. <laughs> Stanley dreamed of wild expeditions into the unknown. So you, don't move me around. <laughs> I'll kick your ass. You can't. You can't look around with that. Like, like, no, I can't. That's why I have to watch TV. Where's TV at? Oh, okay. So, I, I, right. where's the TV at? I don't know where it went. He stepped up from his desk to realize that all of his co-workers, his boss, everyone in the building what is that? suddenly vanished off the face of the earth. The thought excited him terribly. <laughs> so he went further. He imagined just, maybe if you press different buttons. And that he could I don't know. I've tried. The last one, the Y. It barely even mattered what lay behind each door. This is uh, interesting. This is different. Very different. RT. I don't have an RT. No. No. I I press shift or something. I don't have an RT. Which button? I don't have that button. I don't have that button. What? I dislike you, lady. Uh, yes. True. Lovely the room. room Lovely room. Mm, mm, coffee. The oh, I love role. the coffee. But God, I love the coffee business, in this place. Stanley took you know, this place actually has left. amazing coffee. I'm not going that way. This is a very sad story about the death of a man. All right. Stanley. Moment of truth. E on the keyboard. Stanley is quite a boring yes. fellow. He has a job that demands nothing of him, and every button that he pushes is a reminder of the inconsequential nature of his existence. Press, please press seven. Look at him there, pushing buttons, doing exactly what he's told to do. <laughs> now he's pushing a button. Now I did push a he's button. Eating lunch. Now he's going home. I already now went home. I'm he's already home. Back to work. I just Unfortunately, don't have a One job. One might even feel sorry for him, except that he's chosen this life. That's right. Now I'm going to press two. But in his mind, ah, in his mind, he can go on fantastic adventures. From behind his desk, Stanley dreamed of wild expeditions into the unknown. 
fantastic discoveries of new lands. It was wonderful. And each day that he returned to work was a reminder that none of it would ever happen to him. Please press P to watch TV. Okay, so I'll turn around here to the TV and... And so he began to fantasize about his own job. First, he imagined that uh, one day while at work, he stepped up from his desk to, to realize wait a minute. that all of his co-workers, his boss, boss, everyone in the building had suddenly vanished off the face of the earth. The thought excited him terribly. Wait a Okay, I guess we'll spend time with the boys. So he went further. He imagined that he came to two open doors and that he could go through either. At last, choice. It barely even mattered what lay behind each door. The mere thought that his decisions would mean There's something nothing was here almost to too with. wonderful to behold. Interact with the boobies. Make me dinner! What? He began to fill it with many possible paths and destinations. Down one path lay an enormous round room with monitors and mind controls. And down another was a yellow line that weaved in many directions. And down another was a game with a baby. And he called it the Stanley Parable. What? Kids it was such a wonderful fantasy. And so in his head, ah. he relived it again, and then again, and again, over and over, wishing beyond hope that it would never end that he might always feel this free. Surely there's an answer down some new path, mustn't there be? Perhaps if he played just one more time. I'm going to press G tell my wife I love her. I love you. I love you, baby. I love you so much. <laughs> But there is no answer. How could there possibly be? Uh, In reality, all he's doing is pushing the same buttons he always has. Nothing has changed. The longer he oh spends my God. here, the more invested he gets. The it's more gonna he put me right back in my fucking office. One. Okay. I'm gonna press R to go to sleep. And I'm trying to tell him this. That go in this sleep. world, he can never be anything but an observer. <laughs> that as long as he remains here, he's slowly killing himself. <laughs> But he won't listen to me. He won't stop. Here, watch this. Stanley, the next time the screen asks you to push a button, do not do it. Uh, should I press it? I, I, I don't... I, I don't know whether I should press it or not. He told me not to, but the thing says... Oh, fuck it. You see? Ah. He doesn't hear me. How can I tell him in a way that he'll understand that every second he remains here uh -huh. is electing to kill himself? How can I get him to see what I see? How can I make him look at himself? Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. Okay, I guess I'm going to question nothing then. I suppose I can't. Not in the way I want him to. But I don't make the rules. I simply play to my intended purpose, the same as Stanley. We're not so different, I suppose. I'll try once more to convey all this to him. I'm compelled to. I must. Uh, Perhaps. Well, maybe this time you'll see. Maybe this time. And, what? and I tried again. And Stanley pushed a button. And I tried again. Please. And Stanley die? pushed a button. What? And I. What the. F what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god!